everyone, Audra here, and today I decided that I am a surgeon. <laughs> Good afternoon, welcome to the Tool Works General Sign-In, please. Okay. Cool. Name, Simmons. <laughs> Curtis. No one. Howdy. Terry. Abraham. The Lord had said to Abram, Go from your country, your people, and your father's household to the hospital to perform surgery. And Adam. We have a very good success rate here. There we go. Nice to meet you, Aja Bateson. Report to the medical school for your like orientation. I mean, do we do we really need to? I'm already I'm already an expert, I promise. I I'm, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go to the OR. <laughs> oh man. Can I go to the staff room? Oh, Ken Shepard. Oh, Buh. no, no, no. Oh wait, these are people that I kind of need, don't I? Um, the expert during operation will keep an eye on patient. EKG. When the EKG becomes abnormal, he will inform the surgeon and recommend course of action. Don't tell me what to do. Tentacle, Dr. K. The area of expertise of pathological. There are several procedures that need to be followed during operation to reduce the chance of infection. Yeah, we'll we be, we be fine. Isn't that the nurse that's there? Nurse Brewer, primary administrative nurse who's responsible. Facilities include hospital policy, accepting practice. Her role in the operating room is, n is to ensure that the patient is not exposed to unnecessary risk. Eh, she doesn't need to be in there either. Do I really need any of these people? <laughs> Listen. I don't need you. I'll go to my class now. <laughs> Welcome. Um. I'm an expert. We don't need this. Bye. <laughs> Dr. Chen called her home. On line two. Who? Uh. Pound? Uh, sh uh, uh, uh. Um. Five, 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 five. Your call cannot be completed as this time. Uh, I swear that's the, the, that's the number. Wait. No, 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 no. Oh, uh, she's gone. Call Dr. Chen, la home line two. Oh, this is Otto and Wanda's catering service. How can I help you? <laughs> I had to take the phone away so you would stop playing with it. Hey! I was trying to figure it out. Fine, I'm, I'm going down the hall. Uh, 
Okay, I don't have any patience yet. No, I don't want to leave yet. Um, I gotta get people in here. I gotta start working on them. Uh, I'm sure it's fine. We're just going to operating room. Wait. Oh, wait. We don't have anyone to operate yet. Okay, wait. Hospital guideline policy, quiet hours in effect. Nightmare mode? I didn't even know this game had a nightmare mode. <laughs> it's already... Well, y you guys will see. Novice level... Boop. Wait, wait, wait. Ooh. It got it all wrong. A... Uh, bleh. and then you get, you got, there. You can totally read that. You can read it. <laughs> okay. Where's the nurse? Nurse! Excuse me, nurse. Um. Oh my god. This is the prior advertising space. Oh wow, I could put anything I want there. I just gotta tell Gus. <laughs> I never knew that was a thing. Well, it is a thing that you could advertise in games back then like that, but I didn't know that was there in that Pacific area. Uh, nurse? Um, we need surgeon. And... Vascular surgery, that's what we're working on today. Oh, there's no one, there's no one here. Just me. Uh, blah. Oh. Oh. Could you guys tell them I'm a professional? Okay. <laughs> okay, now finally I have a patient in room three. Oh, can I play with the phone again? I, I have to restart, by the way. Joe's Pizza Place, how did I take your order? Yes, actually. <laughs> Where is this one? The sister? Oh. What's up? Patient is 24 year old male. Patient is suffering from abdomen pain accompanied by Blue-like symptoms, nausea, general weakness, and dizziness. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But, I got some news for you, my friend. We're going to take a look at an x-ray, and then we're going to look at- Whoa. And it's Aja. There you go. Take him in for an x-ray. 
Because I want to see your insides. Um. Yeah, this is basically, this is basically your insides. Let's, let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here we go. That is a pelvis. If, my god, if I ever saw one. Listen, I thought you might have been pregnant. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Let's poke him. No pain. No pain. No pain. <laughs> that feels okay, does it? I don't particularly enjoy being poked in the belly button. You might have pain. <laughs> Honestly, this bees are later. Oh shit! <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> Your patient has died from a burst appendix. Oh yeah, that's where that is! <laughs> Report immediately to the medical school and pay attention. God damn it. Dr. Morgan has called from the gift shop on line one. They are waiting for you to show up before they begin class. How are you today? Greetings. Hello. Greetings, doctor. I'm just gonna ignore <laughs> You have received a phone call. Consider the protocol and not to return the call. It is consider poor protocol not to return calls. You may use the phone on the front desk to blah blah. Uh, I, I didn't, I didn't listen. Line one. So, um... Oh. Shit. Oh, well. <laughs> What's up? What's wrong with you? Can I have your gifts? <laughs> Okay, listen, if, you're, if I'm your doctor, I perform slightly better when you give me snacks. Like, char shoe buns are pretty good. You guys ever had some of that? I work way better with that. Patient is 25 years old, female. Patient was admit complaining about acute abdomen pain accompanied by nausea, cramping, and general weakness and dizziness. Yo, are you pregnant? Let's go. <laughs> yeah, the first thing I do. You're pregnant, I'm gonna put you under <laughs> Um... Okay, I'm gonna poke your belly for prosperity. You have abdomen pain, right? Uh... I'm gonna go operate. Let's go. Let's go, baby. <laughs> uh. I I probably should have changed the doctors out. Um. Never mind. I don't need them. I'm a professional. Remember? Remember what happened the first time? <laughs> 
We don't talk about that. I would suggest anesthesia. What do you know? What do you know, Dave? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Okay, uh, uh, uh. It wasn't my fault that she was a big baby. Uh. Gosh darn it. Oh god, they're, they're really putting it down. What do you know? Uh... Let's see... One, two... I guess it's this one? Elvis? Patient is 33 year old male. Patient suffering from abdomen pain, accompanied with flu like symptoms, nausea, general weakness, and dizziness. It sounds like you just got a cold. Medicate him! Your diagnosis and recommendations were incorrect and you have been taken off the case. Report to medical school on the double. Gosh darn it. He had to been disexerbed, didn't he? What did he know? Like I I went to school. Mr. McLean, Clarence Khan, her call from her home on line three. Is this the lady I cut into? <laughs> home. Call McLear on line three. Isn't it just like... Star three? Star? Pound? I really wish I knew how to use this. Cause usually you always have to press either one, two, three, or the pound. As you can see, I, I, I do this often. Shit. Sorry, wrong no- Ah, shit. That's the second door to your right. Uh-huh. I know. Uh... Well, first... Okay, you might have abdomen pain. <laughs> Let me see. Patient is 25 years old. Female. Patient is suffering from abdomen pain accompanied by flu-like symptoms. Nausea, general weakness, and dizziness. Look, your appendix better not explode. about it uh i don't know i mean i do know how this works the 
you don't look so good. You don't look so good. In um, I think we got to operate like no joke. <laughs> Or me that look fine. I don't know what my insides look like. I didn't have one of those. What did I just do? <laughs> cool. I need a place to wash my hands though. What you doing still in there? You're supposed to be in the OR. Um. Okay, this time do not just straight up cut into the to the person without some anesthesia. You got that. You have begun anesthesia. Your patient is now unconscious. Kill. You. Can I can I cut? Wouldn't you rather wash your hands before a surgery? Hell no. <laughs> They're like, no. Stop. <laughs> You're not my fault. They didn't even give me gloves. No. Was incomplete. You make sure to blah 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 blah. Cut all four cartridges of the. So it wasn't even the fact that my hands were dirty. I just they didn't like. I went. I have to go like one, two, three. I don't even know what you're talking about. We realized that the Ultra Viewer Seven Thousand is a fun toy. But that's no excuse for using it. <laughs> well, how am I supposed to know? I got, I gotta look. I gotta look sometimes. <laughs> I guess it's supposed to look like that. I don't like being disciplined. Okay, bye. Um, I'm sorry, guys. I, I'm doing with the allergies again. Oh, God. Um. What? She speaks German? I think that was German. Hello. Good luck. I'm, I don't need that. <laughs> um. Wait, do I even want to... No. Uh, she's gone. Um, I guess I just gotta go. Everything will be okay. Let's let me poke your belly. Okay, what is wrong with you? Patient is a 45-year-old male. Patient is complaining about blue light symptoms including nausea, general weakness, and dizziness. Abdomen pain is also present. Um. Okay. Um. Um... Okay. <laughs> Can I... Admin pain, admin pain. Does that make you feel better? Um, someone gave him a toy car? Wait, how old is he? 45, he not, he's not even old. Why are you already this gray? 
Like, 40 year olds don't get that great at best. At least I don't think they do. Um. Listen. I got the. I got the works for you. You. You are not a lady, so cramping is concerning. You're also sick. Oh, a cute admin hand. I'm gonna play with the ultra scan, scan again. You can't stop me. Ew! <laughs> Why am I looking inside of this? Uh. Okay, turn that off. I'm gonna look at the x-ray. Uh, the... Nope. The sounds are very crispy. <laughs> you know what? I think you just had you some really inspired milk. That happens sometimes you, you just you just grab it from your, your refrigerator, you open it and you just go 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 and then and then you end up here in my office complaining. I'm just gonna look at you and judge you. What? <laughs> your recommendation your recommendation course of action was correct, but you did not follow the correct procedures. <laughs> Report to school. But I got it right! Ah, The Sam a good doctor. Sam good. I saved a life. I saved him. Dr. Koffler is calling from the ER in line one. Cool. Yeah. Uh. Uh, sorry guys, like I said, I'm I'm dealing with the allergies again. Oh my goodness. Doctoring me I'm allergic to it. What I Huh. I'm never going to figure out how to answer this phone, I swear. <laughs> Maybe he's telling me how to do it. You... Your beeper should tell you the correct extension? I have a beeper? Oh man. I remember I really wanted those when I was a kid. Those... Those small bricks that you carry around and people just send you like random messages on them. <laughs> no hospital bill, what? It's fine, don't worry about it so much. Jeez. How do I get to my beeper? Is it like here? Is it here? Am I here? Oh no, I don't want to move the mouse like this. That, that's on the keyboard. Back then when we had to use like the number pad for certain games. It took forever to do stuff like that. So I have a, a beeper. Wait. Can I call for pizza again? <laughs> well, sometimes you just need it. You know what I mean? Um, uh, I'm not gonna call her. I'm going here. Here. 
here. Here. Here. Here. Here. I'll never know how to call. Um, is it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve? No. No. How, how do I get my beeper out? How do I check my, my little pager that I have apparently this whole time? Um. No one told me until now. F1, no, F2? Not F3. F3 did nothing. Four, five. F5 did nothing. F6, seven, eight, nine, nine. Happy Monday. It's never a happy Monday. Oh. Did I call the right number? Okay. One last patient before I go. It will. Don't worry, my hands. You'll be safe. Patient is 32 year old female. Patient was admitted complaining about acute abdomen pain. Accompanied by nausea, cramping, general weakness. I don't know, I'll do what the last guy did. Your diagnostic and recommendation treatment were incorrect and you have been taken off the case. But it worked the last time. I guess because she was a girl. Gosh darn it. But it wasn't le right life threatening. She didn't just end up in the morgue. Hmm. But this is has been life and death. I always like messing around in this game. And also, this wasn't used for any type of educational purposes back in the day. This was just a fun game, but it was kind of, kind of a lot. You kind of had to know a lot of things. And even after you went through the classes and everything, and you really did try it, I think it's still like a, it's a little trying. I can only imagine what that nightmare mode is like. If you guys want me to come back and try nightmare mode, please leave a like and comment below. Because I'm always down for some life and death. But, until next time, I'll see you all later. Bye bye!